As you see, you're looking at the main landing page for Blackboard that we all have. Yours may look slightly different. What I'm going to show you briefly is how to actually control this page to your benefit. The first thing I want you to realize is that the order of things on the page can actually be adjusted. First, you can hide areas and actually delete them if you want to. So by just clicking the little chevron on the left hand side, you can actually move, you can actually hide or disclose items. You can also move things. For example, if you wanted your courses to be in the middle instead of on the right hand side, you can go ahead and move your courses anywhere. And for that matter, any area can be moved. So you can actually float items on the, on the um, landing page. And one of my favorite things to show faculty is the ability to control my courses. Most of us have them on the right hand side. So I'm just going to put that back where you're used to seeing them. But one of the things that happens as you teach here, this list can get very, very long and can, it can be very confusing. So you can actually control what courses are displaying for a particular term. And the way to do that, just go ahead and find the little chevron. It's an actual little spin wheel right over here on the right. And just go ahead and click it. It'll take a few seconds for it to load. But what it's going to do is going to list all is the history of all your classes. And just by simply turning um, a course on or off will display it. So anything that you see blank, that means that's not displaying. And it's so simple. All you have to do is simply, if, let's say that you wanted this course to show, I just check it off. And that means, and it checks all the way across. And that means that now, once I hit submit, it will show. So you can just go through. And for example, let's say that I didn't want this to display any longer. And I can get these checks off. Anything that you no longer want to, so that means those are showing where the checks are, right? But anything that I no longer want to show, all I have to do, and I would clear up anything like this, okay? But anything that I no longer want to show, I simply uncheck it. Okay, as you can see, I have a lot of courses. So let's let's play around with this one, which is my Freshman Academy template. So I'm going to uncheck that. It was showing before, and I've just unchecked it. And I can go to the top or the bottom and hit Submit. So I... I punched in the ACMP and self-study one, and I took off the Freshman Academy. I'm going to go ahead and click Submit. And there you go. The Freshman Academy course left, and my ACMP in course went back in. And that's how simple it is. So just spending a few minutes out there can really make a difference in terms of bringing, you know, helping you to maneuver through the semester much easier. So that's it for our tutorial. I hope it's been helpful.